right now there's a lot of money to be made in the entire bitcoin ecosystem and if you don't know what track at this point is track is basically the decentralized ordinals and bitcoin meta protocol which basically helps you to organize and index all of these different data that we need when they need to be pulled out so that's in a nutshell what track does is like a chain link for the erc20 also track develop tab protocol which enables swaps and sort of like a DeFi stuff and also we have pipe which is the utxo tokens and collectible protocol on bitcoin on the pipe protocol there's some more uh, tools and more protocols being developed like marketplaces dexes and there's some money to be made in this ecosystem and we have a look at track which is the entire backbone of this ecosystem you can see that if you bought this token two weeks ago at 0.35 now you probably will be sitting at above 5x from this point so we are almost touching two dollars at this point and the market cap is 37 millions and i think it's going to do another 5 to 10x in the bull market because that's one of these uh priority coins that they're developing the infrastructure moving forward and pipe is the another uh, protocol and token that we're going to focus today so as you can see recently it was listed at uh, this exchange super x and went from 0.05 to 1.6 dollars and you could have cashed this token for free it was completely free to inscribe you just had to know where to look at if you did you probably made a couple thousand of dollars and i know some people that did that so a uh, huge shout out to them for finding this super super early so a friend of mine created this thread about pi protocol so i'm gonna link it down below so you can read this in detail and you can see how many tokens was already developed on pipe like for example rune or etch or ins so there's a plenty of different meme coins or coins with the utility that I'm going to be showing you. And this is where you can make quite a lot of money if you're going to catch these projects super early. If they do a token sale, so you can mint them completely for free and you can make a couple hundred of dollars. So if you max mint, you can make even a couple thousand of dollars. We're going to have a look at some of these tools and I'm going to be showing you how you can install the Inscribe wallet. So Inscribe is the pipe wallet where you can essentially install it manually from the GitHub website. Then you can see this repository that releases. You want to go and download the dist.zip so then you're gonna go to the location where you download the file right click on it and click extract all or unzip it then you want to go to your google chrome browser click on the three dots to open the settings you want to click on the extensions bar click on manage extension now you want to toggle on the developer mode on the right side and then click on load unpacked and now you want to go ahead and find the folder that you downloaded and extracted so click on this one and click select folder and now you'll see the extension looks like that so go ahead to your puzzle icon and then uh, click on the pin bar so once you install the extension you want to go and click on that then you want to click create a new wallet and then save your record phrase and pretty much that's it so when you're going to have new protocol token inscription release then basically they're going to post their website to a website like Pipeline where you have to mint your art or uh, mint your token and you're going to have this already set up and then you basically put the receiver address that we set up the Pipe Wallet and you will need to click on mint with Unisub Wallet so your Unisub Wallet is going to pop up and then you'll need to basically adjust the transaction fee whether you want to um, speed it up like use the fast or normal so that's pretty much it what you have to do so recently pipeline protocol which is the explorer for pipe where you can put your pipe wallet and it's going to show you what you have in your wallet um so essentially they release the token on this platform where you could have purchased it if you were fast enough you could inscribe this token for less than ten dollars and straight after it was minted out it was on otc market for um 80 to 100 dollars with just one mint so if you max mint it, you probably made a couple of thousand of dollars, which is just crazy to think how um, lucrative this ecosystem is at the moment. So let's say you have one of these tokens in your wallet already. And we have some marketplaces like SatX. And you have to understand that these marketplaces are in beta. So not everything works really smoothly. This ecosystem is super early. Infrastructure is still developing. So there might be a lot of glitches and pretty much everything is over the counter so if you want to sell something or buy something you're better off doing um, that just selling over the counter or buying it it might be quicker because some of these marketplaces um you're not going to get the best prices so if you can see if you want to buy some pipe the prices are um, some of these tokens are super high you're better off buying otc for a cheaper price and once more people are going to start getting into this ecosystem there will be more volume on these marketplaces basically you can do a nice flip later on so another interesting project that i want to show you is runex tech what they do is essentially you can exchange your pipe tokens for the other tokens like ins or you can exchange ins to different tokens not necessarily pipe i thought this is one of the cool projects it's sort of like a uniswap for erc20 and what's unique about them they created pipe collectibles 
So if you were active in the truck ecosystem, um, the Rune X community were sending you these boxes on Twitter. So these boxes basically act like um, whitelist spot for the collectible. So let me show you how the collectible look like. So basically you have this alien, and I found it really cool how basically they onboarded new people to this uh, ecosystem. How you can uh, get these pipe collectibles and trade them or maybe hold them and if you decided to flip these you could have made a nice profit because it didn't cost you anything it was basically your inscription fee which is like less than ten dollars and you could have made around two thousand dollars even more than that so i definitely think if you are trying to get one of these pre-sales tokens or if you are trying to get some of these collectibles there's some money to be made in this ecosystem if you're gonna uh, be early and catch the early runners and if you want to learn more and if you want to discuss this topic further you can join my discord i'm gonna put the link down below and if you found this video useful let me know in a comment down below hit the like button for the algorithm and i'll see you in the next one